When Jane met John in the 1800s and John had asked Jane to wait for him for 10 whole years, what did she do? She waited because she's a good woman like that. Hi there, welcome to my channel and I really hope you enjoy this video. This, is, this video is going to be about the Rickton House and Bush that me and my family recently visited in the South Island. It's in Christchurch and you can um, book tours, if you're ever there you can um, book a tour to um, go to this beautiful place. We went there and I noticed the architecture straight away and I'll insert photos and videos. Um, they have beautiful gardens and around it. Um, currently, um, they have a restaurant or a cafe there that you can have lunch and everything, but we booked a tour and our tour, our tour guide was really lovely. Her name's Anita. So yeah, she made the experience more, more enjoyable. Um, and um, but unfortunately I couldn't film inside but I could take photos which I totally understand because um, you've got to be there to actually experience um, the history behind it and everything it's so much better when you're there anyway um, instead of watching it on TV or YouTube or anything like that I'm just yeah I just I wanted to share how great this place was and everything um, so it's also got a bush behind it which has trees over 600 years old still still there today we went to visit it uh, in the reserve I think it's called um, and I I'll, I'll add a video in here I hope I'm allowed to do that um, yeah so yeah no the bush is said to have rare birds and and those trees like I like I mentioned but a very very pretty inside and out um, inside the house also the architecture is amazing original pieces there um, when they got built uh, when the house originally got built in the 1800s it uh, was built in three stages but Jane had commissioned for the two stages um, for it being built and everything. So, a um, little bit of a backstory: Jane met John on Jane's family Scottish farm where John was working um, for them, and then um, decided to follow his brother back to um, New Zealand for ten years to establish um, them as a farm. Um, you know. Um, to create a life as a farmer back in Canterbury and so 10 years later William sadly passed um, in a shipwreck and so John had then asked Jane would you like to marry me and so she said yes and so John went back to Scotland to marry Jane they ended up coming back to New Zealand to start to continue the life on the farm and uh yeah they had a baby um soon after 10 months after that though john john did pass from tub tubulocosis i think it's called and um so J uh, jane was left to manage the farm and everything and protect the the bush behind it which um yeah it's it's really romantic um you've got to really um go on the tour to really feel you know the yeah the feel the history of it anyway but anyway i'm going to add some videos and pictures and i hope you enjoy so yeah the history is amazing <laughs> Also, um, I don't know if I mentioned this in the in the clip, but there has been a few sightings at Rickton House um, of Jane over the bassinet of um, the last baby born there. So yeah, and there has been 
a few, oh, we were told um, someone had seen her ghost and had um, run out of the room or something like that. I could be wrong, but um, but yeah, we were told that um, people have seen the um, ghost of Jane Dean. And so if you're also into that sort of thing, um, yeah, who knows? You could, you could see her ghost. Hello all, so it is day five in the South Island and we are here at the Rickerton house so it's from I think the 1914s or the 18 something so it's a very historic place and we're about to go on a guided tour so and we've got the hair on his arms oh no he's got his um Right now, shoes. The water jug. You want to have a wash in the morning? Yeah. Hi. Mm. So there is Rickton House, right there. You got the bush over there, and yeah, what a beautiful art piece. Wow, look at all the gardens, the birds. We've just had our tour inside, which was exciting. Um, and now we are heading for food, I think. But yeah, what a lovely house. They made in the 1850s, I think. I could be wrong, correct me if I'm wrong. Um, so we'll go around the house and yeah. Wow, it's so big, it is so big, and inside is so beautiful, so many designs from, uh, designs from different cultures and everything, it's, yeah, I highly recommend this place to come to if you're ever in Christchurch, um, definitely, definitely give this a visit if you're into your history, because, um, it is really, really worth it. Oh, there's so many really nice photos. So, yeah. Yeah. It's really cool. Wow, look at the Fiji Garden. Take some um, photos, more photos um, as I come back. Wow. This is a nice little meadow. Beautiful. Wow. Oh, the ladder. Cool. Wow, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So we are currently in. Oh, is that a Fanta? That looks really dark. Could be the lighting. We are in Rickerton um, Bush right now, and um, it's said to be uh, to have birds like geckos and um, lizards. I mean, you know, gecko is a lizard. Um, Kias and other rare birds. So far, what have we found? Lots of birds. Yeah, a few birds. Fantails and salmon. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We thought that was a big white bird. <laughs> yeah. So we're in Rickerton Bush right now. We've just had our tour, which was fantastic. And we've been walking for how long, Jamie? We've been walking for a few minutes and we're, we're coming across this beautiful bird and it said to... <gasps> wow, another tree that's over 600 years. But I want to keep quiet. Not to scare off this bird. Oh my gosh, is that a pigeon? 
Oh wait, it's not a bird. <laughs> it's not a bird. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's Santa. <laughs> oh no, that was clickbait. That was definitely clickbait. Another tree over 600 years. <laughs> Jamie, oh yes, I got it. Oh, I know. Oh, they have such dicks for that. I'll chop that out. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? I don't know what that is. And then, oh, I honestly, I honestly <laughs> thought that was a bird. Oh my goodness. Another 600 year old tree. It's amazing. So some of these trees are over 600 years old. And I'm not sure about this one, but it's got a sign in front of it. And I'm wondering if that's one of them. Wow. Jamie just um, found this in the bush. That is out of it. It looks like a wand or a yeah, <laughs> magic stick. <laughs> yeah. That's cool. Don't break it, don't break it. It was already broken, I think, eh? Whoa, what was that big flutter? Did you hear that? Oh, this is, this is Jamie, my cousin. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't sure if she wanted to be on here, so. Yeah, but she's on this walk with me and we are enjoying the nature, so, yeah. How did you find the tour, Jamie? Interesting. Interesting, yeah. It was pretty interesting. A lot of history and so many people, yeah. Such, yeah, different cultures too, which was awesome. <laughs> A tree, another tree that's over 600 years old. It is beautiful. It's like joint, joint together. Wow, look at the, wow. That is magnificent. That is gorgeous. Kahi, kahi Katia? Is that how you say it? That is gorgeous. Wow, look at that. So we've just had our tour of Rickerton House um, by the lovely Anita. And she she did amazingly at um, talking about the history and, and touring. Yeah, um, this is beautiful. This place. So it was um, first built about 1850. It was brought by the council in 1914 or 1917. A really awesome awesome story um, really awesome story to go with the house and also the Rickerton bush so yeah that would just come through we saw a few birds um, yeah what a beautiful home and you've got your Dean's cottage there Dean's cottage 